Hello and welcome to the tutorial on skip counting in 100s. In this tutorial we will count in 100s up to 1000. This is very very simple. We're not going to spend much time on this. Let's have a look at our first example. 200. We've got 200. What number comes after 200 when we are counting in hundreds? Well, that is the 100 column. It's a 2. We simply add 1. We're counting in hundreds. The answer is 3. 100. Let's have a look at the next one. This time we've got 500. What number comes after 500 if we are counting in hundreds? Well, there's the 100. We add 1 to it. The 500 becomes 600. I told you it was easy. It's very, very easy. Now let's just quickly work through a number sequence. We've got 300, dash, dash, or I should say blank, blank, 600, and another blank. Now, what is the first one? Well, that's the 100. It's 3. Add 1. It becomes 4. 300, 400. The next one we've got, I'll just put the arrow first, we've got a hun the hundreds is 4, add 1, it becomes 5, 500. And the last one, the hundred is here, it's 6, add 1, it becomes 700. It really is that simple. The entire sequence of numbers from 0 to 1000, if we are counting in hundreds, is 100, in fact, I'll just write it down very quickly here. We've got 0, 100, in fact, I won't write the arrows, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, we'll keep going, 800, 900, and 1000. Counting in hundreds is very, very simple.